Sugar has the potential to tell your brain that one brownie is not good enough. To understand sugar addiction, understand what it does to your brain. That bar of chocolate, another piece that you feel like having, another brownie, biscuit, just one more. Do you feel like that all the time? Addicted, helpless, wanting more. That, ladies and gentlemen, is addiction and we are decoding sugar addiction to you. Why is sugar so tempting? For those with a sweet tooth, it is like addiction, almost like being hooked to drugs, alcohol. What does sugar do to your brain for you to be so helpless around it? The brain's neurons are fed by sugar. You continuously crave more sugar because your brain perceives it as a reward. The brain's reward system known as the mesolimbic dopamine system is stimulated when we consume sweet foods. Dopamine is a chemical produced in the brain by neurons that can indicate whether or not an event was positive. We are more inclined to repeat these behaviors while the reward system is active because it encourages this behavior. Consuming sugar causes dopamine hits which speed up learning and make people seek out more of these meals. What does happen is when we have sugar, there is a release of dopamine in our brain which makes us feel good. Once you feel good, you want to have more of that thing. You know, so yes, there could be binging on sugar, there could be craving for sugar. People would miss sugar if it's not there in, the, in, the, uh, in their diets. Yes, we do strongly recommend against the use of excessive sugar and if possible, very, very limited use of uh, simple sugar in our diets. Why do you feel a rush after eating a midday cupcake? It is simply carbohydrate containing sugar which is readily converted to glucose in your bloodstream. For starters, we know that glucose is the main source of energy used by our bodies when it comes to overall physical wellness and bodily function. Your blood sugar levels rise. Fruits, vegetables and dairy products all include simple carbohydrates. However, they also contain fiber and protein which halt the process. Table sugar, soda, candy and syrup don't. What about sugar lows? Do you suddenly feel a drop in energy? Does everything around you seem irritating? Well, this is called a sugar low. For energy, your body needs to transfer glucose from the bloodstream to your cells. Your pancreas produces the hormone insulin to achieve this. As a result, your blood sugar level may have a sudden drop. You feel exhausted and disoriented after this sudden blood sugar drop and you start craving more sweets to get back to that sugar high. Therefore, that sweet snack you had in the middle of the day has prepared you for more poor eating. Sometimes it's too late to reverse the harm caused by an excessive amount of sugar in your diet. This is why it's crucial to keep monitoring your sugar intake as much as possible. The effect of sugar can be partially reversed when it comes to obesity and other heart ailments. But some damage to your brain's chemistry cannot be undone. This is why it's important to keep a check. Focusing on having a balanced diet with appropriate level of glucose is very important for a healthy mind and body throughout your life. With video journalist Nasir Khan, this is Shitija Gosavi for India Today.